<coughs> Hello. Long time no talk. Uh, so anyways, yeah, look at this place, man. Um, I'm in Orange County, California. It's, uh, I think it's Thursday, maybe around the 16th or 17th. Somewhere around there. I found this joint. Apparently it's the Navy. It used to be, anyway. So, uh, it's vacated. And there's a sign over here that says, um, the Navy is no longer inspecting or maintaining this property at the level of an operational naval base. Safety hazards may be present. Entry to this property is restricted to only those individuals attending events and activities authorized and approved through the Red Evil oh, Redevelopment Authority of the Navy. Oh, la, la, la. it's a long word. Redevelopment Authority. Okay, then. So, uh, yeah. Look at this. And they're not using it for anything. The homeless or anything? I'd say that's pretty lame. And a pretty big waste. But they got homeless people laying all over the streets in LA and San Francisco and everywhere. And this is owned by the people right here. And it's vacated. They could build it for the military and all that. And then they just leave it. Look at that big, huge hangar. I mean, this place is not being used. There's a sign right over there that says so. And it's huge. Humongous. There's an airport over here on this side. There's more property fenced in over here on that side. Something National Park, Tustin, California. Looks like they have a plan for that over there. Available lots, 56 acres. And you can call that number right there. They have a big, huge park across the street. But nothing in, in regard to, like, you know, maybe helping the homeless. No, let's just build some more uh, industrial parks that we can rent out and screw the homeless arrest them for having shopping carts and you know stuff like that there's the number if you want to come over here and lease a spot but right now they're not using it for anything other than you know just to sit here wasted as you can see way all this property right here available for the homeless check out that colorful truck mm -hmm. yeah they got all this and then they have these signs up here like every five feet closed to the public it belongs to the public and it should be open to the homeless so you know they act like they don't know what to do and there's no place for them to go. It's all too expensive. Oh, la 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 la. Yet, right here you have, right here, 50 something acres over there on that side, just over there. I don't know if that sign includes this side, but you got bunkers over here, you got plenty of area to grow vegetables and have chickens and cows out here and help the homeless people out here. There's a place to store all the supplies. Put a big kitchen over there. And you know, there's an airport right over here. Here comes an airplane. So you can fly in and out of the joint. But obviously it's been vacated for quite some time because as you can see driveway is grown over with weeds and stuff. 
I'm just trying to show it to you because uh, I want you to know there's barracks out here. You paid for this. There was a hole in the fence. Obviously, somebody already came through. And, uh, you know, we got plenty of room out here, folks. Plenty. There's an airplane over there going overhead. Hello, can you use this for the homeless over here? Anybody have a brain? Because, uh, yeah, they're out there in the cold. You can even bring the ones from Colorado over here. I'm sure they'd be happy to fix this place up. Over here. This will be a place available to the public. Except here's another sign. Look at this place, man. Trippy. It goes on and on. All the way down here. I could show you. That's why I stopped here today to show you this mess over here. Where they're not using anything to help the homeless people. It's very upsetting that this is going to waste. There's a garage over there. And these people got to linger around my vehicle over here. It's disgusting. With their dogs. So I got to keep an eye on my vehicle because they'll go over there and rip off my the stuff I have in there, you know. So, this is this place. I'm going to show you around the other side. A uh, complete waste of taxpayers' money. All of this. There's nothing out here. At least there was nothing when I got here. And then all of a sudden, these people started dropping down here for dogs. So yeah, this is what you got over here. More government waste. So I'll take you around to the other side and show you. Over here there's a park. There's another airplane. They have a busy airport over here. These little airplanes they have. But um it's really weird because the when I was arrested in Lompoc, the police arrested me in Lompoc. Here's the sign. Look. Those cops, Martinez, uh, she was a real winner, right? And uh, all these people. taking advantage of my rights and arresting me over there, but the ticket, the citation, is not from the Lompoc Police Department. It's from the Sheriff. The Sheriff's Department. So I was arrested by the Police Department and they issue me a citation on the Sheriff's ticket? Book? What's up with that? That's what I want to know. Whoever's in charge here, too, like, uh, I mean, this is quite a waste. So, let's go check it out around the other corner. So, uh, yeah, let me, I brought you over here down to the other side of this joint. It's really weird, man. Like, they put fences up all around it, like right here. All this fencing that you paid for. And then uh, there's this big, huge hangar over here. Um, I guess they have their... They're trying to make it look deserted and stuff, but they probably use it for, uh, like, other planets, you know? Because the government routinely lies to us, so I wouldn't be surprised. But if they're not using it, then I do believe it should be utilized for the homeless they should be using this for something. They have all those homeless people out there in LA. 
in San Francisco and everywhere. Hey, bring them over here. They'd probably be really happy to fix this place up and live over here. Look, we got all these places over here across the street. All these expensive places right over here. And then on this side of the street, they got this, this mess. So, uh, how do these people rate? They live here. And they have all these brand new lights and everything. And over here, the stuff that we pay for, the ones that are out here homeless now, like me, I paid taxes all my life. I paid for all this crap. And then they kick you out here in the street. They build all this stuff with this concrete and everything. There's nobody out here. Tons of homeless people suffering. They could put a drug treatment center out here if that's the problem. All kinds of proactive, uh, you know, humanitarian things they could be doing. But instead, this whole place here is being wasted. All of these buildings, there's nothing going on here. It's an overgrown, abandoned naval center and test in California and what a waste it is I mean what are people doing about it? why can't they uh, you know, use their brain and kind of like open this stuff up and let people live here until they figure out what else to do with it because believe me the people would be fixing it all up using it they have talent they know how to create things out of shopping carts. Imagine what they could do out of the stuff they already paid for instead of throwing them out on the street corner that they already paid for and then telling them they can't even be there after they paid for it. And then you abandon this stuff. Look, they built this in here. All this brand new stuff for these people that are Columbus Square that are living over there. But over here, Vacated. Nothing. That's your government, folks. Your government. Leave me a comment. Hit the thumbs up. Subscribe. Hit the notification so you always know when I start uh, posting again sometime in November of 2023. Right now, it's February. And I'm still on probation. So here I am trying to bring you up to date, which I cannot do. All I could do is show you these things and post them later uh, and tell you about the ticket I got from the sheriff after I was arrested by the Lompoc Police Department. And um, all the papers I'm going through, I have a little file cabinet in my, in my van right in here. And I uh, am getting everything organized on my paperwork in there and so this is the naval area that I've been showing you they even got a sign no walking you cannot walk here okay this is an old navy vase is no longer inspecting or maintaining this property so who is who is inspecting and maintaining close to the public that owns it well 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 what do we have here huh what do we have here? We have another taxpayer funded, taxpayer wasted situation here. Please take note. We've got a lady hiding over here in the bush behind this thing over here with the pink hat. Ta ta. Look, she's back there. She's behind that box. Now I'm going to have to wait for her to come out from behind there. Oh, there she is. Look at her. She's trying to hide behind that box. Oh, 
nothing to do anywhere around here. This place is abandoned. They got time to paint these little things purple for them. But they can't take care of the homeless. What a shame. What a shame, man. What a shame. You guys are embarrassing, man. Driving around in your little cars all over the place. Not helping anybody but yourself, huh? Ridiculous. Ta-ta.